In this week's episode, black bears on the web, scientists on the hunt for an extinct mammal, snake sex life, and a beat up baboon. Starting off in China with a sad update. Qi Shang, a captive bred panda, passed away just two months after being released to the wild in southwest China. An autopsy confirmed He Shang died of septicemia due to a bacterial infection after being attacked by unknown animals. Moving on to Denmark, where a recent study reveals a new use for leeches. The study reveals the blood-sucking creatures store markers of not just their victims, but also the diseases they carry. This makes them ideal for tracking the health of animals in the wild. Over in Yosemite National Park, a new initiative is putting black bears in the spotlight. Yosemite Park and Yosemite Conservancy have teamed up to launch the first ever online bear tracker. KeepBearsWild.org is designed to protect the park's iconic black bears by raising awareness and allowing the public to watch and track GPS collared animals. The site also provides information on how you can help save bears. Heading to Australia, where a team of researchers hope to find an ancient echidna. The long-beaked echidna is thought to have gone extinct in Australia during the last ice age some 10,000 years ago. It can still be found in Papua New Guinea, where it's considered critically endangered. The team of scientists believe it's possible the mammal may still live on in rugged pockets of the Kimberley in Western Australia. Speaking of New Guinea, another species long thought to be extinct has been rediscovered on the island. More than 100 camera trap pictures taken in 2016 have confirmed the continued survival of the New Guinea Highland Wild Dog. The images show at least 15 wild individuals, including males, females, and pups. Highland Wild Dogs are among the most primitive canines alive today. And golfers in Florida got quite the surprise when a mama alligator took a stroll across the green with her 16 babies in tow. The reptilian mother was moving to new digs, a bigger pond on the other side of the course. A new study from the University of Sydney confirms crazy sex isn't great for some male snakes. The researchers say that a frenzied approach to the mating season causes males to age faster and die younger and in worse condition than their female counterparts. In neighboring Tasmania, an unsuspecting squid was attacked by another squid. The footage was captured by an Australian research vessel dubbed Investigator. While it's rare to witness, many squid do dine on their own kind when prey is scarce. Off to Botswana, where an elephant decided to take the scenic route, right through a tourist campsite. While the pachyderm peacefully strolled through the camp with no one worse for wear, it must have been an incredible, heart-pounding moment for the campers involved. We're rounding off with this bizarre footage of two Egyptian geese giving a baboon the business in South Africa's Kruger National Park. The tenacious baboon was determined to get his paws on some tasty eggs, and the geese simply weren't having it. That's it for this week. We want your opinions on these nature news stories. Let us know what you think in the comments below.